Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. Bola Badabo looked into what caused the shooting and has the details now on what happened. Bola? Yes, Lee, the officers were looking for a stolen trailer when they say they encountered aggressive dogs. But those who know the animals are heartbroken. A veterinarian that took care of the dogs described them as friendly. While investigating the whereabouts of a stolen trailer, the Redmond police shot two dogs at a large houseless encampment off Northeast 17th Street and Greenwood Avenue in Redmond Tuesday evening. I got an urgent phone call from an unhoused community member, um, pretty distraught, saying that the police just had shot, shot and killed someone's dog out there. Around 8 p.m., the executive director of Companion Animal Medical Project went to the houseless encampment in response to the caller whose dog was wounded but stable. When she arrived, she saw a small trail of blood and two Redmond officers burying a one-year-old female pit bull mix. A two-year-old female pit bull mix suffered a bullet graze wound. She wasn't bleeding out. It was certainly a graze. Um, the skin is apart. Um, but it was a relatively clean wound. The Redmond police said the two dogs were off-leash and behaved aggressively. A short time later, police say a third off-leash and aggressive dog ran towards the detective, but fled once he shot at it. Its status is currently unknown. We've provided care for um, these pet owners multiple times, so we're very familiar with not only the owner, but also these dogs. Johnson Weinberg said she spoke to the unhoused woman who lost her dog and noted how distressed and shaken she was. It was, it was very traumatic. Their dogs are their lives. The Redmond police declined to interview on camera, but shared with News Channel 21 that the trailer was recovered and the shooting is still being investigated. The findings will be presented to the police chief, captain, and the district attorney's office for review. Lee?